Hey guys, welcome back to Football Manager. Uh, welcome back to the Journeyman series. We're playing as Cadiz. Uh, playing against Wesker today. With my cup of tea. Um, obviously Vico's injured, as is Correa, so we'll have to make some changes. So, Fofo's coming back into the team. Um, and Berenxia will go out onto the left hand side. Uh, Calaro, the midfielder, will come in. And that will be the team we play today. We're trying to keep the same team as best we can to create those uh, lines of um, integration, really. Hang on. Forty. Um, no. I'm trying to... Let's see. I'm trying to see if I can do something that makes players more comfortable. Um... So I play Abel Ruiz as an advanced forward. Bering Steer on the wing. Uh, Fofo attacking midfielder. Um, deep line playmaker and support for Alex Fernandez. Jose Marie can be personalised deep line playmaker who defends. Centelles is getting dropped because he's a bloody diabolical liberty. Um, so Furpo can come in and play wing back. Um, go on, play wing back, um, and then Mangana can come in and play as a wing back as well. Degrees can play as a central defender who covers, where he's comfortable. Simon can go as a sweeper keeper who supports and I think all of them look very comfortable where they are now so quick little change around there and yeah I think we're ready to go let's get to the game okay um, so we're playing a 4-2-3-1 custom vertical tick attacker against the 5-4-1 diamond with wing backs uh, I've never seen this played it uh, by them before so let's see players look motivated that's pretty good let's go to kick off we'll be in our yellow and blue they'll be in black with uh, turquoise numbers good high definition quality it's Jonathan for them to Ferre our Ferre, Ferre Vico is injured um, it's unfortunate Madero out to Yorge, uh, Degrees will intercept that. There's the shadows of the uh, floodlights on the pitch. We're playing at home. Nice big yellow tunnel. There's Fofo to Berenks here. He's crossed. Abel Ruiz. Oh, yes! Oh, he did well to get his head on that. Jovanovic saved the header, but the ball dropped to uh, Abel Ruiz and he snapped it up. Nice big screen in the corner there. And Jovanovic isn't that happy about that. But Fofo coming deep to give it to Berenks here. Abelaru is, look how much he stretched for that. And got the, uh, he had five defenders and a keeper to deal with. Kid's brilliant. So that sends us to third. Third, oh my god. We're in third in the league. That's pretty bloody amazing considering where we picked him up at. 12 or I think it was 12 could have been 13th we've done really well got my Rochdale cup here lucky cup so let's see if we can just I'm sure I told the lads to be more attacking uh, we've had 8 shots 3 on target they've yet to have a shot yet after 15 minutes Send the lads to be more attacking and get creative. Let's see if we can get another goal. Looks like we're definitely pressing them uh, down that right hand side. Um, most of the play seems to be down the middle and the right, to be honest. Bering Steers on the left hand side, he could do with getting hold of the ball because um, he's. Really good player for us. 
not seen Bayer do anything for a couple of games. Um, we might bring on Ferran Torres for him after maybe 55 minutes or something, maybe 60 minutes. We'll see. Um, Alex Fernandez not doing brilliant. Let's see. 6.5. Come on, boys. El Nezri is on the bench, as is the young lad Martinez, so we've got a couple of strikers we can bring on. Uh, Torres is a right winger, so we have options. They've had one shot, one on target. We've had 14 shots, five on target. 53% of possession. There you go. Lads responded well to that. Abel Ruiz. Why did he just kick the ball out then? Did he have a bet on that? Did he have a bet at what point the ball would go out in the second half? I don't understand why he just did that. Mangana now. It's Fofo, Alex. Fernandez puts that one in. Barrick's here! Oh! Young lads at the back post. The cartwheels and everything. Good finish. Good finish. Look at Fofo there getting involved. It might actually just be time to bring uh, Bayer and Fofo off, I think. Just to give uh, Torres and Collado a game, I think. Let's bring Collado on for Fofo and Torres on for Bayer. See if that helps. I think Fofo's complacent there as well. That's 2-0 to us. We're a point behind the leaders. Deportiva La Caruna. Uh, second on goal difference with Real Valladolid. Real Valladolid. And um, Les Palmas are on goal difference with us. So it won't hurt to go get another goal or two. Um, I know Ruiz is playing well, but I want to see this young lad Martinez. He's uh, a regen player. There you go. He's been improving in training. He's 16. So I just want to have a little look at him. Fermin Martinez. He's from our um, under 19s. So. Come on, boys. I'm hoping he gets an opportunity. So we can have a little look at him at least. They made a couple of changes. We have a corner uh, throw in here with Mangana to Collado. Who's tackled by Milanas. Galan sends it down the line. Alex Galar picks it up. Jose Marie intercepts Alex Fernandez. Gives it to Collado, nice touch to Farron Torres. He's sent it wide to Mangana. Farron Torres gets it back. Gives it to Alex Fernandez. Out wide to Junior Firpo. Crosses, Torres with the header. Can't find no one. Retrieves the ball, Mangana. He's going to cross it. Brank Steer at the back post. Oof. Well, he couldn't make anything of that. So the young lad's got a 6.7 Martinez at the moment, but we'll see. Um, here's Galan. Ramacero. Galan to Ferrero. I'm 
Morianas, it'd been good if he passed to Roche. <laughs> uh, for Hero to Roche. Um, Yogi Miraman plays it inside to Milero. Milanes. Referee is going to blow the whistle on this. They're wasting time now. Resimiro. Oh, he's going to lose the ball there anyway. Good 2 0 victory at home for us. And uh, Ander Berex Deer got a man of match with a goal. 7.9. We had 24 shots to their 4. 8 of them on target. They had 2 on target. And. Very happy with the result and the way you played, lads. Well done. Build the morale up. Look at that. You need to start building it up. You can't just say nothing's a address. Bloody assistant. So, quality possession uh, provides victory. Collado makes Cadiz debut. Uh, cage press conference from Francesco. Hmm not our bloke so I don't care <laughs> uh, let's go have a look at how the players did come on I hate this page I've just done a rant about this page taking ages let me pause it for you 10 minutes later Ugh. well what might have been nearly 10 minutes for you <laughs> for me was uh seconds for you um, lucky things Brent's here performance please as Salagrat and I had a good solid game and I expect to see more of the same it's a good player so that's it for us today we moved up into third in the uh, Spanish Segunda second division um, keep tuned like subscribe share all that good stuff hit the notification bell and I will see you all in the next video. Thank you very much for watching. There we are. Third place, play 25. Goal difference plus 13 points, 45. Um, we done pretty good. So, um, next game is against Hehon. Sporting Hehon. Um, yeah things hadn't been going so well there had they and then we took over at Santander and we've won six on the bounce um, but yeah you can see why the other manager got fired um, there you go it wasn't the best results were it um, yeah so I think if we'd have had them from the beginning I think we'd have done a little bit better but he sits on the bounce, can't complain about that. I will speak to you all in the next one. Enjoy your day. Take care.